And I'm returning. Okay. Changing characters? No. Just pretending to change characters. Okay, so today I picked up God of War Origins. Yes, which is the other two God of War games that were like PSP only or whatever for a while. Remastered in HD for PS3. Is that... Well, yeah, that. Where am I going with this? Dumbass. Head out of your ass. You know, I was thinking about what I was gonna, how I was gonna go with that, but whatever. I, it just fucks me all up in the head. Okay, now that I've babbled incoherently for about 20 minutes. Nice shitty weapon there, Yukimura. Awesome. But, um... <clears throat> yeah, I've got a War Origins, which is what I will be working on while this video renders. I will be playing that game excessively. Dep uh, one of the two God of War games that are on there anyway. Because Kratos is just the ultimate fucking badass. And I'm really stoked about God of War 4, you know. It it's being made, we all know it's being made. Osmosis you need for Mitsunari, dumbass, buy that. But, uh, yeah, so... I know some of you guys followed me from the other channel where I did walkthroughs of God of War 1 through 3. All live commentary, of course, you know, so... Uh, my rage was Kratos' rage, etc. You know, guess what? Origins is going to get done also. I need to play the games first, though, and that's what I'm going to be doing tonight. I'm going to start playing the games. As a matter of fact, I'm probably going to devote the rest of this weekend to God of War and just, you know, get, get through those games so I can immediately get started on my live commentary walkthroughs of them. I don't know when they're coming, though. I know some of you guys are probably waiting for them. I don't know when I'll have them uh, done and ready to upload and shit. It'll probably be a little while yet, a few weeks, a couple, at least a couple weeks. Because, you know, i got to play the games first, and then I have to record and commentate and shit. And, and well, other than that, you know, I've got this running and res the Resident Evil series, but that's not that hard to keep up with. I'm several recordings ahead on both now. So, yeah, I'm going to definitely play God of War. I also did get a uh, brand new copy of L.A. Noir for $20. $20. That's really fucked up. I mean, brand new. Okay. I just said, uh, like, oh, $20? Okay, what the hell? Pick it up. I always wanted to play the game, but, you know, couldn't stomach spending an additional $60 on it at the time because it came out when other good shit came out. And honestly, $60 is like, uh, yeah, you guys know. You guys know what I'm, where I'm getting at. I mean, so few games are worth their fucking value these days, especially when the value is $60. Uh, this game, pff, yeah, whatever. You know, I would have glad, I would have paid $60 for this game. Now I'm looking, looking to see how I'm building Mitsunari here. I think I want Blast and Frenzy. Because I believe his special is a Shockwave-style attack, and Frenzy obviously pumps special attack damage. So I don't, know, I don't know if I'm building Mitsunari right here or not, but I guess <laughs> my guess is as good as anybody else's at this point. Well, I, I, when I was playing, this was like the third or fourth day the game had re released in the U.S., so... No one had a clue how to build, you know, a character like Mitsunari. I was just do going off what I thought was the proper way to build his weapon up. I totally skipped that on accident. My bad. Anyway, getting back to what I was saying, I mean, I honestly hate paying $60 for a new game. I do, because most of the time you're not getting your money's worth. I mean, a lot of these games have like a fucking four to six hour campaign, if that, and then you might get, you know, multiplayer with it, which, eh, mediocre to good depending on the game and the type. That's just not worth $60. No fucking way. But, you know, there are, there are these rare gems that are worth $60 and then some that you're going to get your money's worth and and a lot more out of. Yeah, go get them, Zhang Liao. This game, for example, as I was saying, I would have paid $60 for this. I mean, if I had felt like waiting another week and buying this game on for my 360... Uh, uh, because uh, the Xbox 360 got the uh, disc-based release of the game, whereas the PSN, 
PS3 just got the digital download, so thus it was fifty dollars or ten dollars less. I would have paid sixty dollars for it. Why am I using Mitsunari's Muso attack? You fucking noob. <laughs> yes, I am at that point. Oh well, shit happens. I mean, there are there are plenty of games out there that were worth their price tag, but for the most part, I don't like paying that much for a game. And I have a new text. Let's see who it's from. Ah, oh, it's from G-Man. Uh, I'm running over here to save. G-Man says, game rocks, dude. Because I sent him a text saying, hey, I picked up L.A. Noir for 20 bucks. Good. Good deal. I'm on my way over here to save Lubu and Dao Chan, I believe. Or at least attempt to. See, uh, she can run now because of the, the boats, the ships being there. Before, she couldn't run. She had nowhere to go, and that ass clown just killed her ass. But watch this shit. Uh, the ship's there. Hey, how's it going? I'll just run right past her. What the hell? I'll just let her take refuge in my camp. Well, hello to you too, buddy. What an ass clown. How dare he beat me up. You know, I was trying to talk about games and the value of $60 and, you know, the fact that it sucks. You know, I remember when they were $50 and even then, why am I using Mitsunari's Muso Attack? Should have special. That would have killed him. It would have. <laughs> but no, I'm not that smart. Okay, Zhang Liao, get in there. Maybe I'm just not used to using his specials after the fact that I never used him in Orochi 2 because it was terrible in that game. Mitsunari, yep, very good. I mean, yeah, there are other games that are worth their money. Like, let's take Batman Arkham City, for example. Fucking great game in every aspect. I mean, if you liked Arkham Asylum, Arkham City will blow you away. I mean, that's just the way I see it. And I, I loved it. I, that's a game that I just played and played and played. Hated the ending, though. I, I just didn't like the ending, but, you know, based on some articles I had read prior to the game's release, I could understand why that ending played out the way it did. But, ah well, it's still, still a game that everyone should play because it's just that good. You know, now Uncharted 3 was also a very, very good game, probably worth the price tag as well. I mean, though I still think 2 is superior in several ways. Uncharted 2 is probably one of the best games of all time. I mean, no fucking doubt. Look at this shit! <laughs> yeah, we need to work on powering that up a bit, Mitsunari, but, you know, hey, it's okay, you're only level 6 now. <laughs> These enemies are, like, higher level than you. Look at this shit, they're all just, yeah, going flying. Okay. Do not anger Zhang Liao. He's going to just beat the shit out of you now. That's right. Yes, you lost because Zhang Liao was just that much of a fucking badass. Yeah, he's just tearing everybody up. Well, yes. When I'm done commentating this, <laughs> Kratos will be kicking some ass. Yeah, you guys know I like Kratos. Well, there's Mitsunari. Wait a minute. I have Mitsunari. How is Mitsunari? Never mind. <laughs> Kratos is like... Yeah, you guys know I like Kratos. I mean, my fucking wallpaper on the channel is proof of that. I think Kratos is like the ultimate badass, you know. <laughs> I mean, shit, in the very first part of this fucking playthrough, I made a reference to him. That's how much I like Kratos. I mean, nobody is tougher than Kratos. <laughs> Anyway, what, what am I doing here? I'm killing peons. Why am I killing peons? Just pick up the goddamn scroll and weapon box and go. There we go. Okay, level up, Mitsunari. Apparently I didn't get the weapon box. I don't know. Look at these idiots. Go flying. It's good for you. Hmm. Yeah, Mitsunari would also benefit from flak because a lot of his moves knock enemies into the air. Very easily, as a matter of fact. Yeah, don't try and get behind me like that. That's not very nice. I'm beating on your buddy. You'll get your turn. Don't worry. Now it's your turn. See? That idiot with the spear misses. Oh, really? See, now he's going to play the Let's Guard a lot game. There's other ways around that. That, for example. And, I don't know. There's another way around it, too. The C1 gets around guard, but I didn't use it there for some reason. 
Like I said, I'm such a nub with Mitsunari currently, because, you know, it's like I haven't used him in for fucking ever. <laughs> These idiots. Please don't shoot me. I, I don't like arrows. They hurt. Insert lame Skyrim, o lame overdone Skyrim joke here. Anyway, uh, enemy over here. Don't block. Zhang Liao does not like that. You just accept your ass kicking like a man. Look at that shit. <laughs> Another move I don't use very often. It's an officer killer, but why am I using this? Oh, so I don't know. Like I said, such a nub with him. There's an officer there. That's great. I mean, some characters you just shouldn't use their Muso attacks because their specials are just so goddamn good. That's what you should use that gauge for. I mean, I don't know if I can say that for Mitsunari's special right now, but it is actually very good compared to what we had with him before. <clears throat> some characters have just insanely good specials. Like Kaguya, for example, her special is just fucking unfair. <laughs> It, it kills a lot of people very quickly. Okay. Excuse me, I need to kick your ass now. Zhang Liao is making his former army cry. That's what he's doing. Now. Yes, one of these damn archers. Am I gonna go get this officer or just fight archers? Fighting archers gets old really fast. There he is. Excuse me. So you want a guard, huh? Okay, well, I'll tell you what. I'll just wait until you drop your guard, because you're a dumbass. Look at that shit. Hey, you're up in the air, buddy. That's right. <laughs> la, 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 la. This guy is totally done. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Hit me again, please. Please hit me again. That, that was wonderful. I enjoyed it very much. Too weak to play a role in this world. Thank you, Mitsunari. Well, right. If you can kick his ass, obviously he is. <laughs> what am I swinging at? I, I like to swing at the air, apparently, sometimes. It makes me feel special. Like, ha, look at that. I kicked the air's ass. I, I would see one, too. Okay, good. Useful. Greetings. Guarding a lot? Okay, I'll just walk around your guard, which Mitsunari does like it's nothing. Ow. Thank you, Genji. Thank you. Uh, now I'm going to have to wipe you two out. Wait, look at this shit. <laughs> Goddamn cutscene. Fucks, fucked up my triple attack, but that's okay. At least the game doesn't take it away and allows me to re continue use it again. You know in the older Warriors games, if you like triggered your Muso attack or something and then a cutscene would trigger you would lose the attack you know it's like your gauge would be drained when the gameplay restored but the attack never took place that was always irritating you had to know when the cutscenes were gonna happen and shit which like in a battle like this it seems to be time based or maybe when you defeat sermon so many officers I don't know so sometimes it can be hard to judge if it's a good time to use an attack like that or not Oh, they're all charging me? That's nice. I guess I won't have to deal with Sasano then. Again. I just wipe out, uh, I wipe out the Way Army and be done with it. Where's Salpi? There he is. Yep, wiped out. I think this is two battles put together, by the way. Yeah, I just now noticed it's like fucking 40 minute recording. Yes, definitely two battles put together. Yes, Dodgy, we know. We've already seen that, but I wanted to look at Dodgy's ass again. Can you blame me? Hmm. Very good. Moving on.
Yeah, she's kind of required to get Lu Bu, but we'll talk about that later. Ah, not bad. Not bad. Mm, don't use that, but whatever. Crap, crap, crap. <laughs> crap, 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 crap. Well, thank you, Dodger. If you say so, buddy. Interesting. Yay, bonds increasing. <laughs> yeah, Del Chan's interesting. She uses a whip. Has a Castlevania feel to her. It's kind of cool. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, I'll use her in a little bit. Kind of have to. Yes, our army's getting bigger. And as a matter of fact, we're assembling the largest army that never existed. I mean, an army this size could never be beaten. You know, but... <laughs> What am I doing? I'm 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 dancing around apparently. Uh yeah, okay, let's look at some weapons. I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, so being that I now realize I'm commentating a forty minute video instead of what I thought was an eighteen minute video, I don't know if I'm gonna have a chance to start God of War before I watch tonight's horrible sci fi Saturday movie. I oh I often enjoy watching those because they're just so bad. You know, Grab a grab a six pack of beer or something and just yeah laugh laugh at how bad their attempts at making movies are because they they are really bad. I mean it's really sad as sometimes you get some big name actors in these films too. It's like okay where did this person's career go or where did that person's career go? Frenzy, you want that? Uh, I probably want that for the flack effect too. But what I I would take harmony off. As a matter of fact, yes, I would. I'm kind of looking at that. Apparently, I couldn't make up my mind. But, you know, looking at it now, I'm like, oh, duh, I just take Harmony off and put Flack on there. Or I'll just stare at it for another ten minutes. That's a good idea. Let's just look at this. Hmm. Yeah! Oh wow, I actually did what I was thinking. So, even two weeks ago or whatever, probably longer when I played this, I still have the same thought as I have right now. That's kind of cool. It just goes to show that I don't change my way of thinking, I guess. Who am I putting in? I think I'm putting Yukimura back in. Yeah, I am. Yeah, because I remember this next battle. Do I? No, I don't.